Hey again guys, it's GuardWolf21 here again with your vaping review. So, for this review I got three e-liquids to review for ya. I won these off a of Dead Eye Show and Outcast Vaping TV on Vapors TV. And I'll tell you what they are here in a minute, but we're going to run this on the Stingray. It's going to be on the Tobe Top. I just re-wicked it up. It's not a perfect wick, and, but it's a dual coil, brand new cotton up in there. So, here we go. Let's try out. This is by Higgy Sigs. This is Higgy's Crispy Rice Bites. This is supposed to be like a rice crispy treat. Mmm. I got this in my PGVG. I got 40 PG, 60 VG. My nicotine I got on this is a 4 MG. It's 4 nicotine level. And this is only like a 13 milliliter bottle, but they fill it all the way to the top. So you can see the, well, I gotta turn it around here. There you go. 4 MG, 40, 60, 13 milliliter bottle. It's really not childproof caps. I mean, they are easily, you can pull off. There's the top. I don't really in, like the top because it's hard. It's hard to, I mean, for on a, on like a stingray, you could probably drip it on there pretty good, but in a tank, you really can't. I mean, you have to squeeze hard. I've done these in my Nautilus, and you have to really squeeze really hard in order to get it, unless you're going to take the top off, you know, or take a syringe down in there and then pull the juice out. But the flavor profile, it smells like a Rice Krispie Treat. It smells like when you're just freshly doing it, you know, when your mom used to make, used to bite the spoon or suck on the spoon. Let's try this out. See, you can see it's really hard to, I don't know if you can tell, it's really hard to pull the liquid out of there. And you have to, you're telling, you're seeing me squeeze it hard. So, um, let's get this wick. Nice and wet here if we can. And try this out. So yeah, this is Rice crispy Bites, so like a Rice crispy Treat. I've been letting these steep a little bit to see if I can pull the flavor out a little bit more. Because when I first tried them, the flavor really wasn't there. I mean, one of the flavors I have, which I'll be doing a review here shortly of, uh... Actually, it was right there on the point, on the spot. But these ones, these two of these were not, so. It's good, it's good vapor. I give it probably a four. Three and a half to four on vapor. The flavor's kind of there for the Rice crispy. It's not <coughs> pulling all the way out. <coughs> um, it's not bad. I couldn't vape this all day. The Rice crispy, you're not really getting too much of the crispy. You got a little hint of the marshmallow. So the crispy is like in the overtaste background. But it's not too bad. So if y'all hold on a second, we'll be right back with another one from Higgy Sigs. Alright, and we're back again with ya. So for this one, this is really good. I've let, like I said, I've let these steep, so this turns out pretty good. This is Higgy's Boston Cream. 
So the smell is like you went to a Dunkin' Donuts or a coffee shop or something and got a fresh Boston cream donut. This is amazing. So we got this on the tub in the Stingray. Let's try it out. <laughs> Excuse me. Got a little bit of a cold. Um, so this in here, it's about three and a half, four. And it tastes exactly like a Boston cream donut. It's really good. If I can get the juice out faster into a tank, right now as this is, I could probably tank this most of the day at least. At least... At least maybe tank it during the morning with a fresh cup of coffee. Oh, it, it's really good. You all have to let this and try it. The Higgies Boston Cream. Mmm, that's amazing. Alright guys, hold on a second and we'll be right back with your final flavor review. I love this flavor. This is going to be an amazing flavor. So just hold on a second. We'll be right back with it. Okay, and we're back. <clears throat> so for your final one, this flavor is amazing. Like I said, I really don't like most of the flavors, but this flavor, compared to the Boston Cream, this flavor is amazing more. This is Higgy Sigs. Higgy's Banana Pudding. So we're going to try this on the Tobe again. Stingray 0. 0.6. Let's see what we get. Mmm. This flavor tastes exactly like a banana pudding with the wafers. You're getting the banana. I don't get too much of the wafer flavor, but you are getting the pudding flavor on the exhale and the banana flavors all around throughout it. <clears throat> this flavor, I, I love it. I've tanked this flavor. It's really good in the tank. The vapor still three and a half, maybe four. It's probably about a three and a half. Um, but this flavor is absolutely wonderful. When I first got this flavor, I tried it on the tank. It pulled great in my Nautilus. The only issue, like I said, the only issue I have, and the only complaint I have about this, is no childproof tops. And the dripper, it's just too hard. It, it's you literally have to squeeze to get the drips out. I mean, you have to pump this really hard to get the get the dripper and the liquid out of it. That's the only complaint I have about these. Other than that, the flavors are really good. I would give the Rice crispy probably about a two and a half right now. The Boston Cream, about a four. And the Banana Pudding, this is spot on, Higgies. This is a five. Most definitely a five if you like banana pudding. So, Higgy Sigs, I'd like to thank you all for letting me try your juices. And Deadeye, I'm glad and happy I won this on your show. Please come and check out Vapors TV. Vapors TV, there's a bunch of channels. I won this off of Outcast Vaping with Deadeye. I thank you again, Deadeye and Higgy Sigs. Until next time, guys, this is GuardWolf21 with your vaping review.